now let's get this going. Where are they going to send the lanes? It will be Chen out going up top for now. Grimstroke going to head up there as well. To so Now we got to get back into it. Let's keep it smooth. I was like watching the top screen. I Bulba goes down. I might as well with both of them. So it is going to be a carry getting a kill in each lane. Centaur as well as Necro going down. He won't miss any experience, though. The Heart of Tarras, some of the older names. Lothar's Edge, that is, that's the only one. I actually say Shadowblade now. I've gotten out of my bad habits. Arteezy taking a lot of damage, but here's the rotation from Crit. Has the Inkswell. It's level 2. He puts it on himself. The right clicks are enough, though. See you later, Arteezy. Crit gets the kill, but they'll take that. Could put this branch here for the plus 1 strength. And doesn't block it, but gives vision. All right. Oh, he got the kill! He didn't hit the creep, so he got the kill, but now they come evade anyways. Will he be able to even get one or two of these? Looks like he'll get the big Hellbear. He brings it down. They want to rotate. It's Chen. Level 5 gets x Here comes the boat, but Quinn, he's in a little bit of trouble. We'll get the boat. Damage mitigation, at least. And they're going to try to run forward. Do we have a blink up? No, so it won't get the stun, but he still wants to hit the scream. It's only level 2. Throws out another dagger. That's level 4. Doing a ton. It's only level 3. Pardon me. Doesn't get the deny, and the Chen creeps. Nuki him down. Really is back into the game. That is ginormous. Enormous. Still, the Kunkka very far ahead. There's, get him. He's dead. Yep, this is a kill. Perfectly timed by Quinn. As Fly will invade 10 minute bounty runes. The lift, you deny it with your creeps? No, he just ends up getting it. Do we have a clap? Yep, slows MSS down once. Is he going to commit the ulti? I don't think you want to, but you might. Well, I doubt. I might commit the ulti if you're going to get a kill. Meanwhile, RTZ alone, he knows the Reaper's Scythe is down now. Going to be taking a ton of damage. They want to get this kill. He is ink swelled up, slows him down. He's going to turn around, gets the stun up. There's going to be the acid spray. And a double ulti from Rioya hits too. This will be the kill on Gyro's. Well, Fade Bolt comes out, but Rioya, he is 5-1-0. Look at his, his net worth barely moves up, though, as kills. They really do not mean that much. What? I think, oh, Bulba ulted to save himself, but he's just going to go to an SVG, saves the ultimate. That's a nice play. Crit goes down all of a sudden. That's two. Is this three? This might be three people dead. He's going to bring him right back into the boat. Perfectly timed. That's a quick three. That is a crazy three. No true building damage, Jen. Oh, there's going to be the scream. They want to bring down this Kunkka. So damn team. In comes the boat. Will hit Fly. Hits himself as well for the damage mitigation, which is nice. Fly gets the heal off. Centaur will get ultied on Bulba, trying to beat his house. The, the, his ass. His house. Both of them. As the Radiance is here. Ulti goes up. Bulba stays alive. There goes MSS. And they cannot bring down the Alchemist, even with that Spear Vessel. They try to slow him. No, sir. It'll be an easy kill there. On to Quinn. But Rioya goes down. Biver gets another kill. And Yawar from the side. Huge team fight for them. He'll get a BKB and then he'll get plus one. He will be the strongest person on the map. Is two spirit vessel charges on Kunk, almost level 15. Boat is there. Torrent is there. Right clicks with the spirit vessel. Quinn is just raking up the kills. That's level 15. I he might take the the torrent damage for once, but I don't know the HP regions. About no, he does. Yes. I love it. I, it's the same thing as the items. There's less items in the game because there's less gold, which means there's less HP in the game, which means your torrent damage is just a little bit better. Ulti flies out, but he does want it. Gets healed by SVG. Bulba, the only one in trouble now. Torrent, he's gone. Blink forward, really. Gets the kill. He's getting an ulti. Do they have a stun? Rocket is up. Will it be there in time? Blink. He has a Yules. Yules! Blink! Anything! He'll just get run down. And it really is going to be Arteezy versus the world. Uh-oh, Arteezy. What? He's just dead. Oh, my God. And now Bulba's dead trying to save him. EG is crumbling like a homemade cherry pie that your mom made on a summer day. And you're eating the fresh cherries off the top. You get to the crust, and it's just so crumbly and fresh. You know your mom put some freaking graham cracker in it, and it tastes so good. But it's not delicious if you're an EG fan, obviously. If you're a Quincy Crew fan, though, you're watching the end of the game pretty much happen in 21 minutes. Didn't pop BKB, just died. Fly's trying to cut the creep wave. He goes down. 
no, this this is Dota. Dota is so weird right now. And I'm not saying it's in a good or a bad spot. It's just funny to see the, these 21 minute pushes are super common now. They gotta go for this fight. Bulba blinks forward. It's gonna be one fine. It's on SVG. They get the double silence up, but Gyro already casted all of his ultis. It's gonna be SVG going off. Ultis, you mean abilities? I sure do. Now you are getting right click down, has the Aegis. It's a stolen quap ulti from Viver. Hits them all back, and now they're scared. There's gonna be the X. In comes the boat. He can't pull him back though! Because of the Wraith. Well played there. It won't matter. Reaper Scythe on Arteezy. He goes down. And this honestly feels like the game. Your Alchemist has died twice in a row. Do you have an X marks the spot? He's going for the Invis room. No, he gets stunned up. Do we have a lift? The Torrent's there. The lift's there. He's dead. 8k lead. Quincy crew absolutely giving EG the hands right now. MSS. It's the middle. They're going for the Kunkka. He has his BKB. He's going to throw an X. Oh, there's the boat. Has a Torrent as well. He's going for a solo kill, and he's going to get it. Actually, MSS wants to steal it. He won't. Crit buys back. Arteezy going to run forward. He has a stun up. Oh, he's going to stun himself, though. Rocket will help. There's going to be the Gyro ulti. They get the stun up. There's an ult again. Biver with the big boy steal. Alchemist goes down. He has buyback, but you don't want a buyback. There's the cleave. Fly goes down. Rioya Reaper's sight. He's dead. 74. Good game is played. And that was a beatdown. Sven versus Lich and Quap and Bloodseeker. MSS as well as Biver. They continue to just harass Arteezy out, who doesn't go for a point in his blood rage yet. You are. We see the first blood barely. It is crit going down, and that is that is scary to me. Oh, they're going to run forward. He will be able to make it out of this silence. He might need to TP out, though, or he's just dead. He will TP to take a lot of damage, but oh my lord, 20 HP healing selves. So the thirst should fly off of him, but this bottom lane, it's going pretty well. Bottom, that's top grant. It's going to be Boba getting the kill on SVG. Bolas go out, so you are can't get the kill up on crit. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness. He is hiding. He is high. He has vision. Crit has vision because of the war. But now get denied. Crit actually moves through. Yo, what up? He sees him. It's going to be a fight. SVG will be the first one gone on. The dagger goes out. What level is it? It's level three. So doing a ton of damage over time. Crit might be falling first. He does. SVG will get right click down. It's a one for one trade. Make it a two for as fly goes down as well. MSS chasing. He does have the duel, but he doesn't have the damage. He needs a plus one. Yawar just farming. And there's going to be the duel. I don't believe you're getting this kill. You might get the kill, but you're not getting the dual damage no raindrop blocks 120 damage he lives with 110 boba with the treads does a lot of right click damage he's gonna be teleporting in middle they want to maybe get a kill on quinn as well as the tower he will get right click press the attacks on him that's gonna be a silence he doesn't have a yules he should just be getting right click down they go for the safe stun comes out yawar's here as well first one to die is quinn ulti from Rio scales him on back and now oh boy eg is just trampling over crit will get healed up a little but not enough that was yawar pardon me and it's a, a two for one only fly goes down meanwhile you lose the sven and the death prophet they glyph it as well. Crits here. Level five. It feels like EG does have a little bit of a lead in this game. Well, it says they have a little bit of lead with 1k gold, but also just how their heroes work. We saw the Sven TP middle, cast God strength, and then just die. Rioya. Doesn't have blink for 10. Will get sinister gazed in though. He wants to continue to chase. He does not have us blink. He just dies. What? Arteezy kills SVG. Can you go for Viber next? Never mind. We have the dual chain frost. Does get thrown out. There's a no one getting get hit by it. Bounces back uphill. Fade bolt goes. Takes away a lot of damage. He turns it around. And here comes the spend now. God's ring. Oh, the stun hits onto two. Bonk, bonk. Double kill. Plus, they get the dual damage and a one fight. Quincy crew after that one team fight. Oh, there's going to be the rupture. He does get one spirit siphon off, so he's healing a little bit. The rupture just doing so much damage, but it's not going to kill him. They get the duel on the backside. It's going to be really though. They don't have God Strike. They don't need it. There's the kill and the stolen ulti. SVG was getting brought down a little bit, but he should just be able to fly away from this. Does give a little more thirst to the Bloodseeker. But they don't have vision, so it doesn't hit the wyvern. And it's another one for zero. Biver, oh, Biver, you're dead, my friend. There is no way he survives here. Did he? Uh, he got it. 
No! Okay, they're fine. They are fine. It will be right before the 15 minute mark. Damn. Grant, you know it only goes at 20, 30, 40, and, and 50, right? Yeah, but we can pretend like it mattered at the 15 minute mark. Stun flies out, hits the ember. Clumsy nets there. Oh, fly. Will get silenced. Spirit siphoned up and dueled in the kill. Rupture does go down. MSS. He needs to be careful. Will be getting right click. Does he have a teleport? Uh oh. It's going to be the heal. Stun comes out. He doesn't have his god strength, but he does have his mask of madness. He just wants to do a lot of damage. He can't. Nice soldier by Rio. He scares three of them back. MSS might be the next one to die. They want to bring him. Jumps forward with the spirit. Lifted up immediately. Steals it. What the hell? Viver, not really sure how to use it, gets the kill on Crypto. SVG still alive. Oh my goodness, RTZ's dead. What a team fight. A three for zero. And Quincy crew, they want more. There is blood literally in the water. They want all of them. It's going to be a net. Is it enough? They don't have the stun, but Wyvern, he hits him. It's a kill. What a play by SVGesus. They don't get Bulba, but they end up getting Rioya. That is a huge play there. Look at the gold. How did the gold change only go 500 when it was a three for one? There's gonna be the lift. Chain Frost will go to UR. Gets pulled in. Does he have a teleport? He might just want to fight. Throws out a stun. And he just mask of madness eats him alive. Druid will be the next one dead. Clumsy net, but he gets dead. Actually, he's trying to run away. None of them will get silenced. Bulb on the backside, trying to right click. It's gonna be free gold. No, not gold or damage. It's neither as a he goes down. They're gonna find crit as well, I have a feeling. No, crit actually finds MSS. He rolls into the air. Throws out the silence, has him slowed. There's the stun, and he'll just let Quinn get it. That's a freebie. Going to try to push that tier two tower, and it will be uh, taken down pretty easily. BKB almost up after S and Y. Both teams do get an outpost, so that extra burst of experience. There's going to be a fight. Who's going to be the first one to go down? It looks like it's the blood seeker. I have no clue how he got caught. My bad. Well, at least we see the kill. And Crit, he has two more spirits. They don't have the duel because he used it to get RTZ. He is just getting smacked down, though. He gets the bounty rune. Does make it. Wow, he makes it to the high ground. Gets the movement speed. He probably will die. He can dodge one attack with Slight. Killed himself on the. Yeah. And all right. We go right into the pit with the ghost. Will they try to contest crit? They back up. Ghost bring it low below 50%. They are smoked. RTZ can throw the blood right. He does. They all make it out with their move speed. Oh, never mind. Spend it. There's your dual media. They have a frost shield. Do they have the magic damage to get him in the taunt? They do. Crit goes down. Clumsy net. Such a good item to hold, especially that ember in place. They want to go for Roche, but they also want to get some kills. There's a blade mill. I don't think they care. He's trying to be, oh, the chain frost doesn't even bounce once. There's going to be the curse. They're killing everyone. It's a gosh dang slaughter. Bulba goes for the TP, lifted and dead. Four for zero in a Roche. It is an absolute slaughter in the river. My God. Honestly, I, I see a lot of people say it's not good. Dude, it's insane. 35 damage and a mini cheese for like a hero like Sven. All of, it, it's pretty damn good. Oh, they're going to go for the kill and they get it. They don't have to go for it. They might push the base with this. Is under attack. They're going to pop go. They're, this just racks. It will be Bulba split pushing, trying to get a tier three tower of zone, but they just don't do it quick enough. Level three ghost, level three god strength. That's an easy range strike. That's a pretty easy melee. Right? Actually, it's not easy melee yet. Are they going to kill it in time to get the creeps? Uh-oh. This would be a pretty good find. He has Aegis, though. He is completely okay. He just wants to be in better position. Will finally lose his Shadow Strike. Quinn has popped his BKB. Oh, my God. RTZ's just going to die on the backside. Wait. 
the, uh, the Winner's Curse. Oh, but SVG steals the kill with the Winner's Curse. They're trying to bring down the Winner Wyvern. Meanwhile, Fly goes down. SVG finally brought down, but Quinn, he's chasing ahead. No silence for anyone. They're still up. There's going to be the Yules. Do we have an instant lift or any sort of disable? He jumps over to the other side. Rio is there. He actually gave it away. Oh, no. The silence. They know Rio. There's the Yules. Do we have a lift? We don't. He should be able to blink out of here. Maybe. No. There everyone. Another perfect team fight from Quincy Crew. Simple as that. Whoa! I mean, it is over. To be fair, it is over. I thought they might give it one more fight, but it's a beatdown, man. Quincy Crew. They are looking damn good right now. Holy smokes.